Hello and welcome to this Middle Thunder Airborne Let's Play. I'm MMTT and I will be taking you through a single player campaign. Jumping out of an airplane is one of the safest things a man can do, provided he follows proper procedure. When the red light goes green, you jump! Follow the man in front of you! Don't stop! Don't think! Go, 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 go! Here we are in the training mission, the uh, introduction to the uh, her drop mechanism, the main feature of the game. In most missions you'll be able to land more or less anywhere on the map. And uh, you should be aiming for uh, those green smokes you can see, since they indicate safe position with supplies of ammo, health, and sometimes explosives. There are three types of landing, and here I'm doing a grease landing. you're into clearings, look for green smoke. You know why we look for green smoke? Because it's proper procedure! Go, 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 go! There are uh, a series of free per drops to do to trace you to different mechanisms. Three types of landings, a fail landing or botched landing. Sorry for the slowdown here. My traps just uh, slow the computer down. You can do flare landing, just uh, flaring your shoe just before uh, landing on the ground. And the grease landing as I'm doing when you hit the ground right. Most armies experimented with paratroopers in the pre-war era in the 30s. And the first one of the applications of the paratroopers were during the Belgian invasion of the Germans when they dropped on the fortress of Ebenermel. And of the first Crete operation, which was a near operation only. While the Germans were disappointed in its result, sustaining heavy losses, the Allies really felt that per troopers were a new type of warfare that they should exploit and the game focuses on the operation of the 82nd US Airborne Division. 